Trump was right, FISA surveillance memo shows FBI illegally targeted Trump campaign for what seems like an eternity. The left has pushed the narrative that President Donald Trump colluded with Russia over the 2016 election. It's all we heard and are still hearing from the mainstream media and liberal talking heads. Ever since this narrative has been pushed, Trump has continually called it fake news, saying no collusion took place. Now, a classified memo has been given to members of Congress that may just prove Trump has been telling the truth all along. The memo was revealed Thursday, when Republican members of the House Intelligence Committee voted to release it to all members of the House. It was then that eyes began to open to how bad the corruption truly was in the Obama administration's Department of Justice. Fox News reported that GOP lawmakers are now demanding that this four-page memo be released to the public because it reveals alleged United States government surveillance abuses that are described by lawmakers as shocking, troubling and alarming, with one congressman likening the details to KGB activity in Russia. One source told Fox News that the memo details the Intelligence Committee's oversight work for the FBI and justice, including the controversy over unmasking and FISA surveillance. Apparently the memo also describes the abuses of this surveillance when it came to investigating the Trump campaign over so-called Russia collusion. Republican members of Congress are not happy about it. Representative Mark Meadows from North Carolina told Fox News, Part of me wishes that I didn't read it because I don't want to believe that those kinds of things could be happening in this country that I call home and love so much. The facts contained in this memo are jaw-dropping and demand full transparency, Florida Representative Matt Gitz told the news channel. There is no higher priority than the release of this information to preserve our democracy. Representative Mark Meadows from North Carolina told Fox News, Part of me wishes that I didn't read it because I don't want to believe that those kinds of things could be happening in this country that I call home and love so much. The facts contained in this memo are jaw-dropping and demand full transparency, Florida Representative Matt Gitz told the news channel. There is no higher priority than the release of this information to preserve our democracy. Those are some pretty big allegations. If that really is the case, this memo absolutely should be made public. So, could this put a halt to Robert Mueller's investigation? Maybe. Another Judiciary Committee member, Ron DeSantis said, the classified report compiled by House Intelligence is deeply troubling and raises serious questions about the upper echelon of the Obama, Dodge and Comey FBI as it relates to the so-called collusion investigation. We know that Mueller's investigation is full of anti-Trumpers and that Mueller worked under the Obama Dodge. So did he have a hand in this KGB-like surveillance? Only time will tell. That's why we need the memo. Because, according to a report by investigative journalist Sarah Carter, this memo also contains information about the now infamous Trump dossier that alleges Trump colluded with the Russians. Again, we need the memo. DeSantis agrees. While the report is classified as top secret, I believe the select committee should, pursuant to House rules, vote to make the report publicly available as soon as possible. This is a matter of national significance, and the American people deserve the truth, he wrote on Twitter. So how bad is it? Getz told Sean Hannity, I think that this will not end just with firings. I believe there are people who will go to jail. Tremendously bad. It's time to release this memo to the public and reveal the truth behind what is really happening within the Department of Justice.